Hey guys, we're on Dory's camera and we're going to a really cool place. You died, so we'll do with this, which is actually a better camera, but um, I can't see it, so it might be out of focus. <laughs> Dory, where are we going today? Oh, wait. Sarah is addicted. Oh yeah, I am. <laughs> <laughs> so we need a new bottle. So how is, how is it called? Schliers. Schliers. Guys, that is how you pronounce uh, Schliers. Schliers. Schliers, because it's from Schliersee. Oh, it's from Schliersee. Yeah. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. So we taste a bit. Yay, 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 yay. So this is really weird because I can't focus you guys. So sorry if you just hear us and see blurbs. We are on the countryside of things. How's the area called? Um, we are driving to Wiesbach. Okay. It's uh, deep, deep Bavaria. Is it just Bavaria or like we have like the Alp and um, Baden before and whatever? Alpenlands. Before like the Alps. Before the Alps. All right. Before the Alps. So um, the oh, language will get a bit everything. crazy. Oh yeah. I, I mean, I understand them, but it's kind of like ah, uh, no, thanks. <laughs> Is it okay for you? I mean, you grew up here, so it's kind yeah. of normal for you. Give me a beer. Like that. <laughs> I might start talking Bayerisch too. A really bad accent, but I might. Okay, <laughs> cow time. Isn't that pretty? Uh, you can't actually see it, but I assume the Alps are over there, right? Yes. So on a good day, you might see them. Yes. This is typical for this region. You have a lot of paintings like on the walls around windows and a lot of wood. I mean, uh, that is pretty much typical mm -hmm. ish. It's not no. typical, typical yet. If I see one, I'll show you. So we're watching a movie about this up there. And it's really cool. You pay like six bucks, you can see everything and then you can drink whiskey. So that's really sweet. You can have a tour obviously for 40 euros or something, but hey, I got a local. <laughs> See, then you watch the movie first. There you go. probably pronounce it Schliers <laughs> or something in English if I didn't know what it is but this is called Schliersee, Schliersee. the region there's a uh, lake which is called Schliersee, See means lake and this is Schliers and Schliers is a Bavarian single malt whiskey distillery it's amazing they don't do not only make whiskey they also have the liquor uh, liquor beforehand and it's so freaking good and we just tried Mirabelle which is like oh no we had to buy stuff so in there is the store we tried a couple of things which one was your favorite oh, there are so many there are so many but we do like the liquors so liquors yeah, the girl stuff the girl stuff we are not that big of whiskey fans here Schleier. <laughs> Schleiers I can't say it Schleiers Schleiers so here are our bags. Bam. I was chopping wood for about like six to seven hours today, so it wasn't really that crazy interesting. The good part about chopping wood, by the way, is that I now have a really, really nice warm room or like entire lower section. I'm actually about to sweat it's that warm. So I'm good for the night with the wood. And it was a lot of fun. It's, it's good 
therapy, I can say that. Took my time on knowing that Sarah forgot to bring a charger, which is actually over there because I probably put it over there for her to take with her. Um, she had to vlog on a DSLR, I think, so I'm very curious how that turns out. The footage will be all over the place going from G7X to this camera to a DSLR to this camera to the G7X and blah 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 blah, so much stuff. I actually started editing a wedding video and wedding videos take really really long to form because when you shoot with more than one person it's very hard to anticipate what you're going to shoot especially when you don't really know what's going to happen because weddings always end up being different than you think of it. And I've shot a bunch of weddings now for the last couple of years. None of them have been really the same, other than like small elements here and there that I now can pick up like, oh yeah, they're now doing this and I should get this specific shot because I really like how it turned out in a previous thing that I've done. So as soon as that's done, I think I edited about 35 seconds of it, which in wedding terms is a lot because the video is about two to three minutes usually. And that doesn't include like a, an intermediate section where there's like uh, the, the part where they kiss the bride basically. For some reason, I like to edit that in. Uh, that's my style, I guess. And uh, unfortunately, uh, we don't have the luxury of like really high quality cameras that can shoot like a very specific style that I really like. But that's perfectly fine because you have to shoot with the tools you have. And it is true, the best camera is the one that you have, even if it might not be up to par with the camera you normally shoot at. So I'm happy with it. So far it looks fine. I haven't really done much and I don't think the girls have done much either. I actually have 14,000 steps for today. I think Sarah was at 5k or something. So I did more stuff, which is kind of good. At this rate, I will actually lose a whole bunch of weight and gain muscle because every single muscle hurts in my body <laughs> at this point after like an entire week of constantly being active and doing stuff, very, very physical labor. I mean, I like it. It's very, like I said, therapeutic. And it's actually a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun, I have to admit that. Okay, time to end this rant because I've been talking way too much. I think it's good. Let's go.